New at four, there are still no arrests in the Clay County mass shooting that killed one person and injured 12. Clay County officials did meet again this morning to discuss this weekend's mass shooting and club oasis. Some people are wanting the club to be permanently closed. However, some say one incident shouldn't really affect the others. WTBA's Chris Knowles is live in Clay County with the latest from this meeting. Tell you the Clay County Board of Supervisors went into a special session during their regular scheduled um, county supervisor board meeting. Today, the owners of the Oasis nightclub, they came to that meeting to say that they don't think this club should be permanently changed or closed down because of the events. Sheriff Eddie Scott says that the nightclub owners were asking that the establishment not be permanent, permanently punished for the shooting. Sheriff Scott says the club did not follow some of the county ordinances when it came to hosting parties. County Supervisor Lynn Horton says those ordinances are being reviewed. But right now, Council and just kind of seeing what we can come up with. We are not trying to hurt, you know, any of the nightclub owners, but we were making sure this county is being safe. Horton says those ordinances cover guidelines when it comes to security, camera, security cameras, and capacity. We have reached out to the owners of the nightclub, but they have not returned our calls as of yet. As an outdoor club remains closed until further notice, and also the county is not permitting any, uh, giving any permits when it comes to hosting parties for this upcoming weekend. Again, Sheriff Eddie Scott says this is not the time for any of that. They want to ensure that this community is safe and nothing else like this happens anytime soon. I'm Chris Nalls, live in Clay County for WCBA 9 News. Back to you.